Sekta ya ukuzaji wa majani chai kiendelea kushughulikiwa na washikadau mbalimbali kungali na changamoto kutoka kwa walagai wanaoendesha biashara haramu katika sekta hiyo. Waki zigumza karika eneo la Kimunye huko Gishugu viongozi kutoka kaunti ya Kirinyaga wametoa wito kwa bodi inayosimamia sekta ya majani chai itoe leseni kwa watu binafsi ambao wamekuwa kiendesha biashara ya uchuuzi bila kufuata taratibu kama njia moja wapo ya kulainisha sekta hiyo the uh, county commander and county commissioner we know what Ro says about this we don't want you to arouse you into our area unless he comes at tables a license that he has gotten from T-Board showing that he has registered farmers from Kirinyaga County so that he can be able to buy tea. Wakiongozwa na mbunge wa Kirinyaga ya Kati Gashogi Gitari, viongozi hao walisema wakulima wa zao hilo wamekuwa wakipunjwa na wafanyabiashara wa lagai ambao wamekuwa kinunua kilo moja ya majani chai kwa kati ya shilingi 15 na shilingi 25. They are buying that tea between 15 shillings and 25 shillings and they are even affecting the quality of our tea. And when they buy 15 shillings to 20 shillings, wananunua tu mara moja whereas a farmer would get 21 shillings at the end of the month and wait for a bonus about 20 shillings, 30 shillings or thereabout. Sasa bodi hiyo ambayo inawajibika na kutoa leseni za kufanya biashara ya kuuza majani chai imetakiwa kuweka wazi leseni zilizotolewa kwa watu binafsi kufikia sasa na ni kwa nini wanaruhusiwa kununua majani chai kwa njia ya mkato. Wangekojea maybe wangalipwa the 21 shillings plus another 20 or 30 shillings during bonus. So that's a, a loss for our people and it is also encouraging our young people who are easy. Matamshi yake yaliungwa mkono na mbunge wa Gishugu Gishimu Gidinji ambaye aliwashauri wakulima wa wayupuke wafanye biashara hao ambao ni yao ni kuwapunja ili kujifaidi wenyewe. Sisi kama viongozi wa Kirinyaga tuko hapa na kiongozi wa Kirinyaga Central tumejumuika na madirectors wa factory zote ambazo zina form ile inaitwa zone 5 kuambia kwamba sisi hatutakubali wale watu wanakuja kunyanyasa wakulima wetu wa majani chai na tumepata mwelekeo mzuri tumekuwa na kofi na, na tea conference pale kericho juzi na tumekuja na mwelekeo mzuri wa vile mkulima wa majani chai atafaindika Michael Nduya ambaye ni mkulima katika eneo hilo alitoa wito ulinzi kamili utolewe kwa mashamba yao kwa sababu ya wizi wa zao hilo likiwa shambani akiongeza kuwa wakulima ulazimika kukesha mashambani kulinda mazao yao Fred Kombua Undugu TV